fellas and fellow readers. So I'm working on my studio a little bit. I got, I got art. <laughs> hey, I've got a lot of art actually. So I'm going to put a lot more up. Maybe every episode I'll change it up a little bit. Over here, I'm going to get a new uh, neon sign. I think it'll say Good Guy Inc. No, I'm joking. Mm, actually, now that I say it. Anyways, so <laughs> I want... I, everywhere I've tried to create a studio on my property, I've run into problems. I had it out in my barn. It was awesome. I loved it. And then my stupid geese don't shut up anytime I'm there. Like, they come in and they just go... Wah, 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 and I can't do anything there. So I moved it into my garage. And my garage is going to be brilliant. I started building about three weeks ago. The weather was perfect. And it was amazing. The weather is less than perfect now. It is hot as balls. And I'm sweating through everything. <laughs> oh, it's... Yeah. So I'm going to have to get a fan or a temporary portable air conditioner. Uh, but this episode... But I want to show... <laughs> it's it's going to be nice, I swear. But I'm... It's a learning curve. I, I'm, I'm on a learning curve. Uh, but, so, I'm not done fighting. I've got a lot more fights to go, but I need something to do between my, my big paydays. So, my wife and I, we've been talking about it for years. We're starting a food truck. We are. Well, we're starting with a food trailer. We'll see how successful that is. Then we might move up to a truck. Because as manly as I look, I, I'm terrible at backing stuff up. So, it's I'm going to figure that out. Uh, also... Tony Ferguson got arrested for DUI, so in honor of him, free Tony. <laughs> I'm wearing the sunglasses indoor. No, I'm going to take you out. I'm going to give you a tour of my food truck. Now, keep in mind, it's we just got it. We're repairing everything. We're redoing a lot of it. But uh, this is stage one of the food truck. Uh, oh, yeah. The name of our food truck? Food Fight. Check this. As I'm leaving my garage, this is where we set up our chickens. So this is... We start in the bathtub with the chickens uh, until they're big enough to bounce out of the bathtub. Now we set up a chicken coop in the garage for the younglings, and then we merge them into our existing flock. thing about chickens are they're all dickheads, uh, especially the cocks. Uh, whew. If I just put the chickens right out there, the existing chickens, the previous chickens, they peck them to death, so you can't do that. So I'm going to head out to my food truck and show you what I've got. Check it out. My kids are ballers. Got a catcher and pitcher out of them. I can't keep my goats. I've even got an electric fence. I can't get them out. Or can't keep them in. Can't keep them from getting out. Got a trampoline because you got to wrestle somewhere. Beautiful truck. Oh, and the, the food fight truck right here. So we're going to get stickers. We're going to do whole nine yards. Open it up. Oh, and it's all oh, its gloriousness. I am so excited about this. You guys may not know this, but my wife is a chef. Now that we own a truck, she's like actually a chef. Uh, but we're coming in here and it'll fit all of us well. I'm gonna catch my head on this four or 5,000 times every time we, we do it. Uh, I'm gonna have to wear a hat just to protect myself. Boom. Um, we got a, a flat top, it came with it. Uh, I don't think we're going to do much with that. We're going to do primarily pizzas, maybe a couple other things. Uh, all this stuff came with it. Uh, we'll get to use it. We've got the outlets. We've got the under storage. We've got a refrigerator. Oh, right here, we've got our window, our ticket window. You guys might not know this about me, but uh, I met my wife at a renaissance fair. I was selling steak on steak, and all day long we'd be out there and we'd be hawking to our customers. Oh, thank you, mate. Hey there, love. Uh, we'd just be talking all day. So that is our ticket window right here. We'll open that, we'll just be, hey, who wants a pizza pie? Step on up. Oh, and then every time they tip us, we're gonna get a tip jaw. We yell, huzzah! I'm sorry if this is too loud, I'm very excited about this truck. Uh, cabinets, woo hoo, coming out. Oh, look at our baby goat. Oh no, he's on the wrong side of the fence. Like I said, I have an electric fence, but these goats, they still find a way out. And the little ones don't love me just yet. The big ones all like me. They know I feed them. But the little ones, they're still, you know, teat fed. So every now and then, they, they all get out. But the teat fed ones, they, they're hard to get back in because they run from me. See the little one? It's like two weeks old. He just wants to be by his brother and sister. But if I get close, it's gonna run from me.
Come here, little cop. Oh. Well, that's how it gets through. That's good to know. I didn't know I could do that. Oh. And there's Artem. He's our one male. See, these, I didn't even see them. They were, I don't know how they got out. I don't know where they got out. I don't know how they're doing it. The electric fence is supposed to stop them. I just had them in the barn. I had them locked in the barn. So I know they didn't get out that way. At least I think they didn't get out that way. That's Mama Rousey. They'll eat anything, I guess. They just want to eat here. I'll do a, mil a goat milking video here soon. And then we've got our horses. So that one's Khan, or Cobra Khan, as we like to call him. He's kind of a jerk, but he'll come out here and eat everything. And if he... Hey, Khan. Hmm. And this one's Whisper. She's our old mare. She's 26, I want to say. And she's a good one. She's very loving. Hey, Whisper. Ooh. And then, oh, there's my food truck from a distance. Food trailer from a distance. So as we're walking up, you'll see. So we're, this is the, the coloring we had with it. I've already taken the counter off. I sanded that down. We're going to reattach it. Uh, we haven't decided yet how we're going to repaint it or if we're going to wrap it or what we're going to do exactly, but it won't look like this forever. Now, if you ever see me out and about, uh, in, in, you know, the food, food fight truck, patent pending, uh, in the food fight truck, you hit me up. I will give you a good deal. If you see this video and you're ever, I will give you say 25% off. Ugh. You're going to love it. My wife, we're, we're making all the cheese. We're making all the bread. We're making all the tomato sauce. We're, we're going to have us uh, primarily pizza, but we're going to do something else. So every day that we're out here cooking and all that, it's going to be pizza-verse tacos or pizza-verse barbecue or pizza-verse euros, uh, whatever we're making. But so then they'll be fighting all day. And at the end of the day, we'll keep, we'll keep a tally of as to what we sold more of, what made more money. And uh, we'll just have a blast with it. So... Thanks for watching. Uh, look for the food truck, the food fight truck uh, locally. And if ever you want us to cater for you, hit me up. We'll make sure we do it.